With Flight 2 confirmed to be only for the PC platform for the Halo Reach flighting program, it leaves a lot of Xbox players wondering why not us? In this video, I will explain why and 343's reasoning. How's it going everybody? It's Kevin here once again, giving you another news update when it comes to Halo. If you guys you like these news informational videos, please make sure to tap that like button. It lets me know you want to see some more content like this. Leave a comment down below about your thoughts on the video as well and why no Xbox when it comes to the Flight 2 for uh, Halo Reach on PC. And if you're new to the channel and want to stay updated with anything Halo related, make sure to tap subscribe because it keeps you updated with everything going on with Halo. So let's get right into the video here. So in a previous news video I posted up guys, we were talking about how the Flight 2 program for Halo Reach is going to be coming to just the PC platform for playing Firefight. And I saw a lot of comments on my last video on that one, which got fantastic support. So thank you guys so much for your fantastic support on that video. And uh, a lot of Xbox players are going like, why not us? How come only the PC players get the first two flights? How come we get left in the dust? We're Xbox, like we're the, the loyal fan base. Why not us? And I can totally understand your frustrations because obviously you guys have been playing Halo forever. Halo's been an Xbox game forever pretty much and so wondering like why does the pc platform get so much preferential treatment to this well so i thought i kind of had my thoughts and reasons why but nothing really confirmed so i thought what i would do is actually reach out to 343 to ask questions for you guys be like hey why no xbox basically so i went to twitter and said hey post them sketch unishack pretty much the main guys sort of part of the community teams especially when it comes to uh halo and uh, just over at 343 in general they would probably have the best answer for this question it says i've been seeing a lot of comments about xbox players being left out uh, for these flights i have my assumptions why but any word why xbox players aren't part of these flights i'm assuming it creates unnecessary work that slows down the production of mcc coming to the pc and that's basically my assumption was going into it is like yes it would be really nice to have xbox players get a chance to just do these flights as well because obviously like they need to test things out on top of that but the thing is is that the xbox is a known setup like you can everybody's xbox is the exact same thing Xbox is at 343, Xbox is over in London, Xbox is over in California, everywhere else. It's the same Xbox, the hardware wise, and there's only like, what, three to test for or something like that? And when it comes to PC, there's a lot more to test out. Essentially, everybody's PC setup is different as for in some way or another. So there's a lot more testing that needs to be involved with that. But now you're probably thinking like, well, just be courteous to the Xbox players and just release a Xbox flight. But what ultimately what that does to run a Xbox flight along with a PC flight and have the Xbox one there just out of courtesy, it creates a lot more work that ultimately slows down the production of reach coming to the MCC. And because obviously 343 wants to do a bit of a universal release when it comes to bringing the M bringing Halo Reach to the MCC. So would you want to be able to play Reach right now on the Xbox, but then have to wait longer for the actual release of the game? Me personally, you know, like I said, I wasn't in Flight 1. Maybe I'll get in Flight 2, we'll see. But uh, I would much rather for the greater good, you know, hold off my wants and be sure to get to that end date of a release sooner. So let's get into what Sketch said and when he replied to my tweet. Sketch replied back saying, Xbox will be included at a later date. There's a lot more work to be done on the PC side. Xbox is more of a known quantity, but there will be reach flighting on the console. So pretty much uh, it reassured my assumptions right there. So, but it's great to hear it from 343 themselves rather than me, just a guy on the internet, just kind of making logical conclusions rather than uh, coming from 343 where it's like, yep, that's exactly what's happening right there. And it's really great. I really appreciate Sketch replying to the tweet on that one. Uh, just so, you know, kind of help ease the nerves a little bit of the Xbox players. I understand being really frustrated training for you guys not be able to play uh but you know say you know it's for the greater good of being able to push out reach on the mcc sooner than later which i'm all for that and don't worry though you xbox players will get a chance to flight reach it's just not right now at this moment i'm assuming that we'll also have a multiplayer flight 
and maybe with that one we'll have uh, Xbox and PC for those flights because I think with the multiplayer it's pretty much like a known thing especially after the first two tests when it comes to PC for the flight one and two I think that for flight three we probably will have Xbox and PC playing at the same time I'm assuming that will happen sometime in August and then by the time that was done they analyzed the information I would assume a release September release for reach coming to PC and Xbox one for the MCC and keep in mind that the next flight program is going to be happening for flight two it's going to happen at before the end of July so that's really close guys uh, we do have a community update coming up pretty soon from Unicheck I'm sure there'll be some more details about it then if you guys want to stay up to date with anything make sure you tap subscribe on the channel because we definitely will be talking about it as soon as that news happens guys trust me so if you guys like this video please make sure to tap that like button let me know if you want to see some more content like this leave a comment down below what your thoughts are on it do you feel like Xbox is being screwed out of this or do you think three four three is being more efficient with their time i would say they're being efficient with their time and sorry for xbox players but eventually you will get to be part of it just a little bit of patience is always needed and so thank you guys so much for watching i greatly appreciate it if you guys are new to the channel or miss any content for me check out the videos on the screen right now and i'll catch you all in the next video peace out